Willie with San Jose Motorsport, home of San Jose BMW. Uh, today in this video, I wanted to talk to you a little bit about gearing. Um, this video applies to all BMW S1000 model line bikes and all M1000 BMW model line bikes. Um, this bike we have here today is a 2023 S1000RR. Uh, just kind of for the purpose of talking about components and some of the procedures and, and changing gearing. Um, good to have a bike here. Uh, let me start by saying um, gearing is, is a really awesome way to change the performance of a bike for your needs, your specific needs. So for example, we go to Bonneville every year and race all kinds of different bikes. We've taken S1000s out there and set some Bonneville speed records with it. You imagine you're going to try to accomplish a top speed around 200 miles an hour. Um, so whether tuning for something like Bonneville where you're trying to accomplish top speed or you're going to one of the racetracks that we love here, the local ones like Laguna Seca or Sonoma Raceway, those have a much lower top speed. So to optimize the bike performance and rider performance, you will adjust gearing for the different kind of situations. So um, on the 2023 S1000RR, it's coming with a 17 tooth front sprocket, a 46 tooth rear sprocket. Uh, this has changed, you know, when the bike was first introduced in 2010, it remained 1745 um, for many years. And then in 2021, they introduced a 46 tooth rear. Um, this is just important because when picking sprockets, it's really important to know what you're starting with um, when, when moving in a direction. Um, this bike, the way it's set up here, it's coming with the M endurance chain, which is just awesome. Um, this chain was introduced by BMW. Um, and is a maintenance free chain. So it does still need to be replaced. It does still wear out. However, when the bike, when the chain's on the bike, you don't have to adjust the chain um, uh, and you don't have to lube it. So those are just two awesome features of the, of this particular chain. Um, I gotta say, you know, these bikes are geared almost to do 200 right out of the box. Um, and I like to ride fast and I go to many of the racetracks here and, and do so but um, that's just out of the actual range. So what happens is the whole gear ratio is moved up and I'm finding that you're having to um, uh, shift, you, you know, change my riding style to work around the, the gearing. So uh, one of the ways we can easily do this is we can change either the rear sprocket or the front. Uh, it's important to note that like, depending on what package, you could have three different wheels on your bike. And this is, uh, I think, you know, okay, maybe not for all the years did they have three, but currently they have a cast wheel. They have this M Performance, um, which is a milled aluminum racing wheel, and then they have a carbon wheel. So each one of those wheels has a different fitment, a different requirement for the sprocket. So kind of for example here, I have two Alpha Racing sprockets. Um, we use the Alpha parts because they are the official race partner for BMW. And so working with BMW so closely, they have the absolute nicest, most uh, engineered parts, uh, very much like the S1000. So um, you can see here the inner diameter of these two sprockets rockets are drastically different. Um, so we're, we're professionals of this. We help people with this all the time, depending on what their kind of use case is. So if you want to just get some advice, reach out to someone in the parts department. They're well versed on, on the different years and the, and the optimized um, kind of ratios we found for different uses. Um, and same with the service department. If you want to schedule an appointment, they're well versed in this and can engage with anyone here at the dealership to make sure we're getting you all the information. So. Um, or if you're a racer or athlete, you know, racing one of the race series, we currently support some Moto America and um, then the local uh, club racing for a lot of racers. So um, we, we stock tons of alpha parts, not just these gearing ones. So kind of another important side note that, you know, there's different wheel offerings, but on, um, there's also some parts that are one-time use. So on this front sprocket, uh, and kind of commonly what I'll do when someone gets a new bike, I mean, this is, this is a really nice chain obviously brand new gearing. It's hard just to take that all off immediately, but they want to change the performance. So I could, uh, we do sell front sprockets. And for this reason, you could just change the front sprocket, continue running this M endurance chain. Uh, if you're racing, you might want to go to a 520 um, or a lot of riders do still like to go to 520s as well. Um, that's a little bit thinner chain. You can run a 520 sprocket on a 525 chain. So when just getting going, you know, uh, and, and not knowing exactly what you want, we could make a, a change on the front Front here and then after some riding you'll, you'll have some feedback we can kind of dial it in and tune it with the rear sprocket so if you just want to lightly get into it change change the performance of the bike or something you could just put a front sprocket on um, uh, our team here would make sure not to forget but if you're ordering this online or something don't forget the one-time use sprocket uh, or little uh, washer here um, so once the sprockets installed on the bike um, 
we have this really nice Alpha Racing aluminum front sprocket nut, quite a bit lighter than the steel one. It's also got these nice little three flat sides. So you, when you ping over the washer here to keep the nut from backing off, um, it's just really nice little uh, deal. Uh, we also stock this uh, Alpha Racing special tool. This is really awesome, especially if you're racing and you're doing this, taking this front sprocket off a lot. It's really important. What this does is this actually removes the load from the gearbox. So when you put a, a big, huge wrench on here to, to break that heavy, heavy torque on the front nut, if you're putting those forces through the gearbox, you can damage the gearbox. So this is a really cool, nice tool from Alpha. It slides right between the frame and the uh, teeth on the front sprocket. So it takes the load and it pushes it onto the frame member here where it's really strong. Um, so certainly no impact removing of the nut here. Um, and to take it a step further, I would highly recommend using this tool. This is what we use in the workshop here to make sure that we're not putting those forces onto your transmission. So again, if it's uh, special tools, if it's gearing help, if it's uh, anything racing, we're very, very knowledgeable about it and we'd love to help you. If you wanna reach out to us and set up an appointment, we'd love to um, help you with your riding needs. Uh, don't forget, we've been modifying, tuning, and racing BMWs since 1974.